Hello guys, how's it going? We are back in Chroma Endless again. Uh, today might be a little bit of a shorter episode, but we do have at least a couple of things that we want to do. Oh, there are the apples. Okay. I was hoping that we had apples. Uh, we're, we're basically going to start out with another Gaia fight. Um, and I realized we weren't really doing ourselves any favors. How much gold do we have? We weren't really doing ourselves any favors with the food that we were using. So, you know. I figured, why not get a stack of golden apples? That's probably going to do a little bit better of a uh, time is saving us. The other thing that I wanted to do... is make an apple sapling if I could. We probably don't need to, but we're just going to plant one over here. Just that way we have a decent supply of apples if we did ever need to. So we'll just like plant that there. Uh, we'll go ahead and sleep and get ready. My microphone used to be wonky today. Uh, we're also going to quickly go to Journey Map and take off all of our deaths. Which there's only two of them, but... We can also take off the End Portal. The Mushroom. And that should be good. Okay. We don't really want those. Let's look at our backpack. We're going to move those there, so we will automatically eat the golden apples. We're good on mana, we're good on everything else. I think now it just comes down to a matter of... Oh, can we win? Holy cow, uh... I fixed my sound and now I can actually... We're actually gonna turn this down. Uh... Um, what's this gonna be? Is it gonna be jukebox? We're also going to try and do a little bit of a better job of taking out these little fairy things. Because I think these were what was really hurting us last time. Goodness. I can't tell what heart we're on. Okay. Skeletons with the enchanted bows are the scary ones. I'm not really paying too much attention. I'm trying to get some of these fairy things down. I can't see Guy's health bar either, so I have no clue how it's going. Holy cow. That was so stressful. That was so stressful. Oh my gosh. Okay, so... Let's put away... 
the mob drops that we got. Oh, we got a glowstone. I'll take that. We got mana pearls and mana steel. We got a music disc. We have 16 Gaia Spirits and a Will of Tarag. Okay, so then we can pop that and we can pop that. The Fruit of Grisian. Ah, okay. And then if we look at... Nope, this one's the quest book. We killed 100 skeletons. Ooh, experience pearls. We have really needed those. Oh, and it just gives it to us every single time. I'll take that. That's decent. Um, we'll just claim everything. Because I don't really want to go through each and every one of these quests. But we definitely got through the f this one. We can buy sphere ingots? Did we not already do that? I would have assumed that we'd already done that, but okay. We did get quite a few guy spirit. Let's stick some more of this away. Oh, we got free white candles. I'll take those. We did really need the experience pearls, so I'm happy that we got those. We also have runes of sloth, runes of wrath, and quite a few more runes of pride. Um, let's look at this, because what, it was the alpha man's ate the fruit of this one. In the supply of nourishment. Okay, that's a bit interesting. What? Okay, so this is just saying that those are the relics, and then like, the dice of fate, and then you get one of them. Okay. So nothing too much there. Okay, but that was the next Gaia fight. I'm fairly happy with that one. And then what, now we can probably make better items now? With the Gaia spirit, you can make the magical eggs. Heck yeah. Um, we can also do upgraded beehives. Heck yeah. Um, I don't really know what that is. Um, we can make a catalyst for the undergarden. Anything else really big that we can do? Doesn't seem like it, so. But, realistically, right, this has opened up well, I mean, we might as well go ahead and we'll craft at least two of these while we're here. Because it goes like that, I believe. I'm going to have to obviously make more of these fights. Um, while the, the fruit of Grigea is really great and all, I don't really think we're going to use it since we have unlimited stake and I don't really need to get mana. Um, the other thing that I wanted to look at, right, this is the Will of Tarag. Is is there something similar to this? And like, you can only pick one kind of a thing. Because if I can only pick one, I don't really know if I want to pick the one that does like... Yeah, these right here. I mean, does it tell you exactly what this does? I mean, we might as well. We're going to be using this for a while. So that's fine. I feel pretty happy with that. I mean, it didn't even take that long. It was a pretty easy fight once I had the golden apples. I'll just like put those kind of like down there in the corner for the moment. Yeah, that really wasn't that bad. Um, this... Oh, yeah. Ta-da! We did that. But this one here. 
the magical egg. Egg. Okay, so we need an egg, but... We do need to start getting these experience pearls. Do we have experience harvester? No, we do not. That's something that we're also going to quickly apply to endless quiver and veil efficiency. I got a sworn that we had experience heart. Oh. What is that, like 17? This is also going to be our sword for a little bit, right? Right, I don't think like there are any really... I mean, I guess we could make it into a star collar, but I'm pretty happy with... Unless we wanted to do that, make it into the Terrastill AIOT. That seems like it might be a little bit much for our means here though, so we're just gonna stick with it. I meant to apply this a lot. Oh, we need 35 levels. Um, let's... Oh, we can't pump it. Okay. Oh, we get an extra magic lag. That's great. Um, store all. That puts us at 25. 30, 31, 32, 33, 34. That should be 30. 31, 32, 33, 34, 35. The caption will come back. It'll repay us in the end. I believe. Because, holy crap, 35 levels is a lot of levels to spend on something. Um, but, we can now make the cursed and the blessed, and I guess technically the blurst. <laughs> um, how do we make this, though? Earth crystal, rotten flesh, inner pearl, slime, and bone for cursed fluid. For blurst, we have to do pig iron, feather, earth crystal, bonded leather. Oh, it's just a leather block. Okay. Is there a difference with the with the blurst? Oh, you have to use a pneumaticraft fluid mixer. Yeah. So we aren't there yet. So we can definitely make like two individual mob farms. But that is definitely our next goal. Mob farms. And we're also just gonna... Wow, we drink very fast. Okay, we're gonna want these. We're gonna want those. Our wrench and our pickaxe. Okay. So I guess we get to start working on some of these things. Wow, I I really did not expect. Oh, this is the I want to get the XP solidifier. This is going to be really helpful. A singularity tank. Oh, solid fuel engine. That's an interesting thing. Okay. So we're gonna need four iron plates and some fluid tanks. What do we need? We need copper plates. So two copper plates. This iron, yeah. Four iron plates. Who knows? Maybe one day we'll actually do something with that. Um, we're gonna need eight brass plates. Is that three or four? But that's three. Okay. That just turns in. Okay. But this, this is where it's at. 
Um, I think we have everything else needed for those. I think it's just a matter of getting to that point. I could probably use that to make plates a little bit faster. But, you know, it's it's all okay. Okay, so we're gonna need those. And then we're gonna wanna craft that. And then can we just go right in and craft that? No, we need a piston. What are we missing for the piston? Smooth stone. Surely, yeah, I was like, surely we have stone. Okay. Do we still have stuff in here? We do still have a whole heck of a lot of glass. Yeah, I haven't upgraded our mana diamond furnace in a long while. We should probably look into seeing, because I think the next ones are what? Fire right? I think we technically have access to fire right now, so... That's definitely something that we can do. Okay, we also need a bucket. Good thing we have these beautiful XP tanks right here. I guess we should probably take it from, like, that one. Okay. Piston. That gives us the EXP solidifier. That gives us the EXP mold. The jelly mold. And then if we were to put that there, with... We can push it. Um, do we have a barrel? Do we have a chest? Dang it, I always forget it's planks. I'm just so used to just saying wood that... Okay, and then if so if we stick that there, push we wanted to push west. Oh wait no. We wanted to push which direction is this? North. Okay. On. And then now if we flip that. Wow. And it only uses a thousand per. Well, this works. This is certainly fluid XP bucket, fluid XP bucket. In it. I don't really know what we're gonna do with all of this XP. I mean, I guess just we're gonna eat it, but how's this doing so much? Seven buckets worth. We have so many buckets. The quests just keep giving us buckets. It's honestly ridiculous. Okay, but so now we have those, and then we can make the cursed fluid. Can I favorite this? So that way if I just click on this, yeah, okay. Ender pearl, slime, and bone. How's this doing? Three buckets, two buckets. How much do each of these give you? Um, this would be so fun. If we just have like an absolute ridiculous amount of these things and then we just have to eat them all.
that holds 20 some buckets worth. Okay, but I was trying to see whether or not we can actually like put these in our backpack and have our backpack make them eat us for it or eat make us eat them for us. Wow, that was a random string of words there. But that would be so fun if it did. I'm just trying to get like, uh, okay. Just trying to make sure that like we can actually get to the hunger level that we need to to eat. This would be so fun though. Like genuinely the most random and probably outrageous thing for it to do but so highly entertaining. Oh, and I just realized that with our new experience harvester enchant on our sword, which I definitely thought that we already had. <laughs> that's, that's so amazing. That's actually so fun for no reason that's just the most like we've hit peak we've hit peak <laughs> i mean i expected that to work but at the same time you know i just definitely did not expect that to work <laughs> okay sorry getting <laughs> getting back on track we need an ender pearl bucket we need Bone block. Isn't that made with bone meal? It's nine. Make our bone block. Then we needed what? Slime, rotten flesh. Ooh, come on. Stay with us. Rotten flesh. Um, do we have slime? Is that all it wanted? That's a congealed slime block. It wanted a no. It wants the full. Okay. Full slime block. And then we need what? An earth crystal block. Uh, let's look at. Are they in? Did I just put it in here? I did. Okay. Earth crystal with like, what, eight more? And then we have our bucket of water already. Oh, but yeah, sorry. I got so distracted. What I was saying is with the experience harvester and our Gaia fight, thing with all the mobs that Gaia spawns we're gonna get a bunch of the little experience pearls which will be really really nice Th that will be so helpful I will say I I know that this falls into many utilities I do wish that many utilities had a book because it's a little hard to remember slash gauge it because of the fact that we don't have a book. Why do we have crab legs? I mean, I guess I haven't been eaten yet, but... Weird. Uh, but it's a little it's weird to gauge how things are going to work in the mini utilities mod. So, it would certainly be nice to know what exactly it is, because, again, we we don't- I don't know. Like, I know of past experiences, but it, this mod has clearly changed quite a bit since the last time I used it, so I have no clue what's going on. Which I guess is also still very usual, but... And then what, we needed a bucket of water... And... 
What am I missing? Has to be heated. Um. Oh. I'm just concerned about how this is gonna work is my biggest issue here. Um, why are we not allowed to make this yet? We need semi-stable ingots. What do we need for semi- mana diamonds? Oh, we need ludicrite. Darn. I was really hoping that we would be able to make the dark ethereal glass, because that lets us walk through it. But what if we just look at glass? I'm sure that there has to be something else that lets us walk through it. It can't just be only the many utilities. This is a lot of stained glass. Holy cow. Because I could have sworn... Yeah, non-solid, reverse ethereal. Yeah, there's glass essential. Only solid to players, not solid to players. We want this one. So we can... How do you make the ethereal glass? With eyes of ender. Okay. Which we have quite a bit of. Um, I'm glad that I went through and I remade a lot of that. Okay, so then this makes gla ethereal glass, right? If we do... Hmm, if we do... How big do we want this thing to be? Say if we do a 4x4. Four 4x4 four. Four four blocks. Right, because a 16 block mob farm should be enough to carry us for quite a while so that's what that ends up being a six by six so we're gonna need 36 to go around i'm trying to math this a little too much but there's a 36 there's a 36 wow all of that and we're already out of glass how are we already out of glass? We should not be out of glass already. Um, we can start... And then what? I think we just set this up with coal kind of a thing. And that's dark ethereal glass, yeah. We're gonna experiment with one piece of this. Can we break this? No. We would need silk touch. Um uh, that's really annoying. Do we have silk touch in here? Scavenger. We do have a silk touch book. Um, do we have any pickaxes that we can use? That's... For crafting only. Crafting. Crafting. What if you look at pickaxe? Crafting, crafting. We can do living wood or living rock. I don't really want to spend a lot. That's a 300 durability with mana steel. That's basically going to be what we're going to get. Because I don't really want to spend a lot of money on it. This is kind of just like a small thing. Just to ensure that we can use it. What's that? That's 191. So yeah, this is probably our best bet just to ensure that we have it. Um, we'll come over here and we'll apply it. 
Ah, oh, dang it, the thing stole our mana. Okay, well now we at least have another tank we can use whenever we need to. And we're just gonna start eating these. I wish I had the trinket to let us eat things faster. Is this still not full? Holy cow. Up oh, there's some levels, okay. I don't imagine this taking, yeah, that was about to say, like this can't take all that much. So now can we grab it? We can. Oh, and this is unli- <sighs> Mana steel is unlimited as long as we have mana. Heck yeah, man. Oh, I forgot about this. Um, we're gonna, we're gonna take those away for a little bit. Okay. So then, back to this, we want eyes. We'll just do another stack, and right, this should be good. I'm a saving. That should be plenty of glass. And then we can take it, ship it directly into like, a container, yeah. We have big plans. Uh, we're probably not gonna start them off on this episode, just cause it's already late, and that's probably gonna take a little bit more planning. Um, first earth. We're gonna try something, and it might be really, really stupid. We're also gonna, like, try it over here. Is it that you... That's how you do it. Okay. And then you just, like... Okay, this makes so much sense. So you just plop that in there and then... Ah, we just want this to be normal pickup. Or... Yeah, just a normal pickup. Okay, there we go. Just had to make sure that that was all sorted down. That was kind of funky that our dink wasn't working correctly. Um, those are still doing decent enough. And we are soon to be getting mana, like, absolute insanity. It's a good- we're, we're doing great. We're doing so good. Okay, last thing that means that we're gonna want to want. We're gonna want a mob masher. So let's just go ahead and look that up. Because I know that we can definitely afford this <laughs> right now. Yeah. Um, we can do block of iron. Diamond gears. I'm just trying to set up the rest of this right before we leave. Obviously there's still going to be some setup tomorrow and... Or, er, well not tomorrow. But next episode. There will still be some setup as well. But hey, I'd say that we're doing pretty good. There's one diamond gear. And then what? The electron tubes. I'm surprised we don't have the iron spikes. Unless, of course, we just like stuck those in this blocks chest, which is probably exactly what we did. 
<laughs> that looks a bit more filled in. Do we still have a create chest? No, I didn't think that we did. But, so, we just need the two crushing wheels, which is inside alloy and brass casing. We can do that fairly easily. And then we just need the electron tube. Which, again, like, none of that is super duper difficult. We can even go ahead and make the electron tube right now. We're probably going to want a couple of these as well, but... Again, it's nothing all that big. I feel fairly confident in our ability to do it. Uh, we might have to go find some andesite though. So, oh no, we have it. Let's get that cooking. I guess mixing. Man, our iron farm sure is slow, but I suppose it works. You stay in there. It, it, I mean, it gives us our nugget supply. We'll just say it like that. Iron farm, it's not great. Gives us our nugget supply. Uh, we also get to start working on drawer upgrades. And we're going to have to... Right, because we're going to need a mob fan. Again, that's not hard to make. We're probably going to... Grab one of these. Ooh, Shadow Seal will be fun to re go back and make. Um, an absorption hopper. Because I don't think this thing. I think basically we're just gonna like what? Upgrade sharpness, make it go faster with a bunch of brass and gold. That's not bad. And then we just need the absorption hopper to. Make them go very, very fast. Uh, and then we'll just need a drawer controller, which what should be up basic storage. Then basically we jump into drawer controllers and just have it start going like crazy. Our wood will be put to good use. Okay, but I think we can call this one an episode. We've done quite a lot between, I guess, technically another source of unlimited food, which we seem to be doing very good at recently. Uh, just all around, yeah. We have our wonderful XP babies that we now have. Oh, can I, like, step in lava to, like... Here, what if we take these off? Why did this give us full... Why did this give us a full thing of... My gosh, what did we do? What did that? Because that was crazy. Here, take all of this out. We have one source of food. Do you like to have to automatically eat? Where is the saturation coming from? I genuinely don't know. Because that's crazy. It's definitely easier just to eat it then, I suppose. Huh. I really don't know where that comes from. I will see you guys in the next episode, though. Bye, guys.